Hello guys, this is Mike from Nitro Speed. Hope everyone's doing well today. It's Western's birthday, so um, do something a little different for this uh, Monday. Doing a collection of my convertibles. And we're starting off with the Audi R8 Spider. And there was a super treasure hunt of this, which I wouldn't mind having, because this is a gorgeous casting. Love this blue. Hot Wheels just kills it with their, with the, uh, blue paint variation of this. It's absolutely gorgeous color. I have quite a few in here, so this might be about an 18 minute video. I got some really cool looking castings. Some American cars, JDM, uh, European, exotic, if you said, if you will. All right, guys, our next one. I'm gonna go and roll my sleeves up here because I don't want to knock anything over. All right, let's go to the next one. Next one is a Triumph TR6. And some of these might be, a couple of these might be racing cars, but they're still convertible. Open roof, as you will. And I uh, love this color. I have two color variations. I have the, the green and this burgundy color, which I love this burgundy color. Or candy apple red. It's a great cast. I'm glad I have this one in my collection. I would love to have one of these without all the numbers on it, but I can understand because it's designed as a race car because of the roll cage there in the back. All right, guys, go to the next one. Next one's a Mazda Miata MX-5. In yellow, I love this yellow color. Really nice uh, deep tampa work running back. And this is a Matchbox. I think it's Matchbox. Wait a minute, I could be wrong. No, Hot Wheels, I'm sorry. I can tell by the, uh, the wheels. That's a great cast. I absolutely love this. Really a nice looking color. A really cool gold one uh, to show you next. And it is from Matchbox. Alright guys, next one. Chevy Camaro from Matchbox. Absolutely gorgeous. A Chevy on the license plate there. Uh, I tell you, this camera really works good on my cars. Really works good. I wish I could bring it up just a little more so we can see a little more on top of the car. But it does look great. Yeah, I'm going to have to do some work to see what I can do on this. Yeah, some video testing. But this is a great casting. Absolutely love this Camaro. Looks really good. Really nice tap work. I tell you, in the past two to three years, I would say three years, Matchbox has really stepped up their game. Their detail on so many cars, their Really a nice looking uh, collection of Matchbox, but I love this Camaro. All right, guys, next one. Next one is definitely Hot Wheels. It's a 65 Ford Mustang convertible. I had this one for quite a while. And, uh, guys, as you know, I'm not much on convertibles. I don't go nuts over them, but I... I do like to bring them out from time to time. So, uh, that's a gorgeous Mustang. I just wish there had been a tamp work on this. 
I like the orange with the red uh, lining around the flames. Really like this 65 Mustang. It's really nice. All right, guys, next side, next one. I have, what, nine more to show you? Quite a few. I didn't bring them all out, but I wanted to bring out some really nice ones today. So, video's kind of early today. I might be doing a video tonight because it is President's Day, so there's hockey on all day. Especially early, so. Guys, next one from Matchbox 1971. Chevelle Convertible. Oops, sorry guys. Okay, there we go. No tamp work on this one, but this really nice looking Chevelle. Love the... It's like a gray, like a light gray color. Really nice looking. No tamp work though, front or back. It is a great looking casting. I love the wheels on this. It's got the three, three star on there, or three spoke, I should say. All right, guys, next side, next one. Hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Smash that thumbs up. Comment down below. Let me know which one was your favorite at the end of the video. And please subscribe, guys. I'm up to 408. Alright, guys. Next one. 57. Yeah, 57. Yeah, 57 Ford Thunderbird from Matchbox. Absolutely love this one. I have like three different color variations of this, but the orange is definitely my favorite color of the uh, three that I have. Absolutely gorgeous casting. Beautiful looking casting. Really nice tamp work on the back there. I can't remember if there's on the front. As you can see, the wheel cover on the back there, front of the trunk there. But that's a really nice casting. Yep, there's tamp work all the way around. Good. Real nice casting. I love this color orange. All right, guys, let's go to the next one. All right, here we go. Next one. This one is a real classic here. 1941 Cadillac. Kind of vertical. I have this one in green as well. I have one, a uh, closed one as well. A boxed one, I should say. But that's a gorgeous, absolutely a gorgeous casting. Absolutely love the color of this, too. It's got that cream yellow. Really beautiful casting. Real nice tamp work. I tell you, Matchbox nailed it with this. Absolutely love this. Gorgeous, gorgeous casting. But no tab part though in the rear. It's still a great looking 41 Cadillac. Convertible or cedar. Alright guys, next side, next one. Wow, that's gorgeous. Absolutely love Matchbox and Hot Wheels combined. They're such great die casts. All right, guys, next one. 49, I believe. Yep, 49 Merc convertible. Or Cedar on this one as well. Uh, this one, I think, came out about three years ago. I was lucky enough to find this one at uh, CVS. Great looking though. I love the color of this. It's like a burnt orange, dark burnt orange in color with flames, white and yellow flames on it. It looks really good. No tap work though, front and back, but it's all done with the uh, flames on the sides, front and the back. Love the white walls, so it looks really good. 
All right, guys, to the next one. We have five left. We're just over 10 minutes. Hope you're enjoying the video, guys. Smash that thumbs up, comment down below, let me know which one was your favorite, and please subscribe, guys. Next one, 63 Austin Healy. Another one of my favorites. Uh, um, convertibles of my collection from Matchbox, and it looks just amazing. I absolutely love this casting. I love the dual colors of the really light uh, green and white. Looks so good. And this car is from the UK. Absolutely love it. I think I have three more. Three more, yeah. I have three more from the UK and one from Germany. All right, guys, past your side, go to the next one, just over 11 minutes. That's some really nice convertibles in my collection. Just got done cleaning the interior and uh, wash, wax, and buff. Look how nice these things are, really clean looking. All right, guys, go to the next one. There you go, guys. It's a Porsche Speedster, guys. This is another one of my favorites in my collection. Really like this casting. Absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Beautiful. I love this shade of blue. It's real nice tamp work front and back, but it can do without the Forza on the sides and on the hood. It looks a lot better, but I know why they do it, so. Still makes up of a great looking Porsche Speedster. All right, guys, go to the next one. Night. 1972 Sunbeam Tiger from Johnny Lightning. Glad I scored this one. Got this in Walmart about a year and a half ago. It's absolutely gorgeous casting. The wheel's kind of messed up there. Absolutely love this casting. Gorgeous. Love the color. Now, diecast Lini or uh, Phil from uh, Diecast for You 2C, let me know is this uh, a car that was made in the UK? This uh, Sunbeam Tiger, I think it is, but I'm not really sure. Let me know in the comments below. All right, guys, let's go ahead and go to the next one. All right, guys, next one. Oh, yeah, Jaguar. 1956 Jaguar XK140. Got like that navy blue. It's really a gorgeous casting. I have four different color variations of this. As you guys know, I love the Jaguars, the Austin Healy's, Aston Martins. That's absolutely gorgeous. I love the Jags. They're just such nice castings. This one is just so really, really nice looking. You can see the uh, license plate, Jaguar 56. It's like a European license plate, but driver is on the left like we drive here in the U.S., so it's possible it could have been designed for here. All right, guys, let's go ahead and go to the last one. Four, just over 14 and a half minutes, guys. Last one, 1956 Aston Martin DBR1. I saw Diecast Sony bring out this one, and I absolutely love the color of this. Four different paint variations of this one as well. 
I love these uh, European uh, cars. Just absolutely love it. I love the body style on these. The old school body style. Love the rims on this. Just such great casting. Absolutely love it. Well, guys, that's going to do it for the video. Hope you enjoyed it. Smash that thumbs up. Comment down below. Let me know which one was your favorite. And please subscribe, guys. I'm going to head out and watch me some hockey the rest of the day. I'm already ready for the day. Laundry done. I just got to take out the trash. And uh, so, guys, take care of yourselves. Be good to each other. Be well. I will see you guys in the next video. This is Mike from Nitro Speed. I'm out of here. See ya.